this is Jim Lakey with news and announcements for St. John and Maxville, Kansas on Cable Channel 3 and on SandyLandCenter.org, our website. Today is Tuesday, the 11th of October. It's 69 here in the square at noontime. We're having a partly cloudy day today. The high today will be 84. And the temperatures this week are going to be like a yo-yo. So today it's 84. Wednesday it's going to be partly cloudy and windy and 58. And so down it goes. And then on Thursday, uh, back up to the middle, uh, afternoon or evening showers, 62 the high temperature with a 40% chance of rain. And then on Friday, Partly cloudy, 74, and then back up high for the weekend. Sunny and windy on Saturday, 87 the high, and on Sunday, sunny and 84 the high. So that we really have a lot of different temperatures this week. So every other day is a different uh, weather to be looking at. Well, we have some birthdays. Happy birthday today to Robert Frank. We hope you have a great birthday, Robert. And then on Thursday to Weymouth Allison. We hope you too have a great birthday on Thursday. Uh, we do have a uh, announcement of news that uh, the VIP Center in uh, Maxville is, is suspending its Senior Fellowship Meal Program. And uh, that's very unfortunate and a sad thing for seniors. And uh, we hope that they'll have some things happen that will uh, encourage them over there at the VIP Center and perhaps uh, they can uh, get some of the folks in Maxville to be a little more motivated to help out. Uh, it's too bad when the Senior Meal Program uh, the fellowship meals for seniors uh, goes away because there are a few people who really need to have that available to them. So our thoughts go out and our prayers for the folks at VIP Center and in uh, Maxville and for the city of Maxville uh, that that could be restored somehow as one of the things that happens in Maxville. Now we've got our announcements from mostly the Recreation Commission, but a few other important ones thrown in. And Thursday is coming up very fast, and the lunch punch is going to Mom's Place in Seward, Kansas. And uh, they leave the Recreation Commission at 11. They have lunch at Mom's Place, a special roast beef dinner. And they return to the rec commission after the lunch, and it's uh, 12.50 for the trip and for the lunch. So it looks like a good opportunity to go over there. Uh, they have a really great place over there, and so I'm glad the Recreation Commission is going to make use of a really good local restaurant in a small town. Well then, on... Uh, Monday, the 24th of October, the Sunflowers are having their Halloween party, and that's at 6 o'clock in the evening at the Witt Center. So that will be coming up very soon. Uh, then on the 25th is a trip to the Corvera National Wildlife Refuge and uh, having, uh, I guess, lunch at the Gathering Place in uh, Stafford. And that's another really nice place in a Saint, in a uh, can, yeah, in our county's uh, area, and so it's a good thing the Recreation Commission is supporting all of these organizations in our county and also doing great programs, particularly uh, for seniors and others to go to. The cost is five dollars for this, but you have to pay for your own. Uh, lunch at the uh, gathering place. <coughs> and then we have uh, two uh, annual things that happen. The first one is the 30th annual turkey dinner at the St. John Catholic Parish. And that's on Sunday, the October 16th 
at the Witt Center, the Catholic Witt Center, and it's nine dollars for a ticket, and kindergarten through sixth grade are, uh, let's see, are five dollars, and then under five years old is free. They have raffle drawings and all sorts of other things, but they really have a great turkey dinner that most of us have enjoyed going to, and you don't want to miss the turkey dinner Sunday. Uh, let's see again, October 16th, so coming up very, very soon. And then <clears throat> the Wednesday after that is the United Methodist Church Women's Soup Supper and Bake Sale, which they have had for every year. And it's uh, for the women's mission work that they have. And the soup supper is chicken noodle or chili and a sandwich, and then uh, dessert and a drink, and it's seven dollars for adults, and ten years old and under is uh, three fifty. And they have homemade baked goods, and they have lots of other things that you could buy, along with the soup supper to raise money. And those are all of the events that are happening uh, that people have told us about, and uh, we do hope that uh, everyone uh, will help out over in Maxville and maybe be able to get the fellowship meal program restored somehow. Well, the word of the day is this. Now that I've gotten it all together, I forgot where I put it. This is Jim Lakey saying have a happy Tuesday and a great week.